We shouldn't see technology as a barrier. We should always take the advantage that technology presents us to empower elements of society and governance and, and use technology to encourage innovation, to encourage growth, to encourage sustainability. Uh, the biggest problem you're facing on the continent here is that only 7% of school leavers attend uh, tertiary education or it takes about 12 to 14 percent of graduates to sustain economic development. So there is a huge problem in Africa and it's believed that uh, distance education can be a shortcut to um, increasing access to education. Immigration, when we see it from a, an African uh, perspective, it comes mainly from the rural areas, uh, from people who, who actually have really the issue of their commodities not being valued properly that brings people to into poverty and of course they, they try to escape this situation and the best way is to emigrate without electricity it's impossible to have a modern life of any sort that actually creates that inclusivity it's really the foundation of everything that comes from that from trade to education to health etc and that's why we we have a strong belief that actually the, the attempt of solving poverty is first by solving energy poverty. Once you solve that, it's actually a gateway to actually, actually solving poverty uh, as a whole.